Hi guys, welcome to another quick Photoshop video. This is probably going to be one of my uh, quickest uh, uh, videos I'm going to make, um, showing you a method of um, adding a toning effect to your images. This method is uh, very simple, very easy, and it's going to probably only take two or three steps to do it in. This is more for a uh, beginner. There are more, there are other methods within Photoshop to do this, but like I said, this is just an easy, quick tip. So let's get started. Here's a picture uh, I'm using. This is a photo I took in Warnit down in uh, Melbourne, Australia. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to first start off by adding a adjustment layer. I'm going to add a Huey saturation adjustment layer. I'm going to go to the preset drop down and click sepia. And that's it. I've already added uh, the toning effect to uh, to the image. Now, what's so good about this is this adjustment layer allows you to adjust uh, the toning to your liking with these three sliders. So let's get started with the Huey slider. This one adjusts the color or gives you the different colors you can apply to your tone. So I'm just going to go for more of a, a bluey kind of tone. The saturation is how bright or how strong you want your, your toning. So if I go all the way to the right you'll see that it's it's a dark blue. If I go all the way to the left there'll be no tone, it'll just be black and white. So I'm going to go more to about 18 there. It's a subtle little tone. 17 even. And the lightness uh, is basically how dark or how bright you want um, your image. I'm going to go to more a plus 4, uh, maybe even a 6, just to bring it up a little bit. And that's it. Like I said before, this is for more for beginners. I hope you got something out of this. Uh, please don't forget to comment below and tell us how you do your turning effects. Thanks for watching.